This is some of the most aggressive, best news we have ever heard in crypto. Make sure to stay tuned right to the end. A very short video just for you, my friend. Welcome back to the Crypto Bliss community. Thank you for being here with me once again. Truly appreciate you. Well, let's dive straight in. President Donald Trump is strongly considering a 0% capital gains tax on Bitcoin and crypto. This is massive. Now, my friends, let me reread that to you. President Donald Trump is strongly considering a 0% tax gains on Bitcoin and crypto in the USA. That is absolutely massive. Now, bearing in mind that we have come all the way from kind of like even zero dollars, 0, 0.000 something, okay, to achieving what in this cycle is a $94,000 high, even this, um, this post is even done in November, but it's still even not the right thing because we've pumped up to 94,000, my friend. And so I lead you down the rabbit hole and I just want to say to you that this is most important. Listen to this. Trump, never sell your Bitcoin. Never sell your Dodge. Well, I sold my, I did. I sold my never Bitcoin. sell your Bitcoin, right? So that's Donald Trump speaking right there at the Bitcoin conference. And uh, that is incredible because he is telling you not to sell your Bitcoin. Why is he telling you? Because they're about to accumulate Bitcoin. So he's telling you what they are doing. They are doing it with extreme good energy. Okay. And we are about to see things transform over in the crypto space. And hence why I'd like to share this little quick video with you here. But Trump, I will fire Gary Gensler and appoint a new SEC chairman who believes America should build the future, not block the future. So listen to what he has to say here. On day one, I will fire Gary Gensler and appoint a new SEC chairman. I didn't know he was that unpopular. I didn't know he was that unpopular. Let me say it again. <laughs> On day one, I will fire Gary Gensler. Whoa. Even though it's all a game, because that's all it really is. The point is, is that if this man does exactly what he says he's going to do, he's going to have a lot of backers, he's going to have a lot of money, and he's going to have the uh, benefit of his nation benefiting out of trading crypto and investing in crypto and benefiting from crypto, my friend. So that's why he's there to help protect the wealthy. Okay, he's there as a businessman because he knows what this is all about. And more than that, this is the breaking, breaking, breaking news as I've just started with. President Trump wants to eliminate all capital gains taxes and cryptocurrencies issued by the US companies. This would ultimately make all profits Americans make on holding crypto assets such as Cardano, Algo, XRP, and HBAR fully tax free as their creators are US companies. The source claims that the legislation requires the companies to have been registered as entities in the country before having issued the crypto assets. Yet, there will be a path to relocate businesses with existing crypto assets on the market to the United States. This strategy, my friend, is part of the broader goal of the Trump administration to make America the crypto capital of the world. My friend, he is achieving this one step at a time. And uh, source is from the member of Trump transition team. So effectively, this would make made in America cryptocurrencies the most logical investment for US citizens as they'd not 
have to spend up to 37% taxes on their gains. It could totally reshape the crypto market. Wow. Imagine saving 37% of your money. How much on an annual basis compounded that is going to put you and your family in a much better position, my friend. And that's exactly why you, this post is so relevant. The next $94,000 victim is around the corner. This is what happens is that you get the doors open, but there's nothing there. Okay. And at the end of the day, you know, this is what's busy happening. Bitcoin is blasting through these numbers. In fact, on the monthly chart for Bitcoin, we actually did a freaking 40% candle, as you saw in that video up above there. Now, there's something that I just want to point out to you. Okay, so I'm just going to zoom out for a moment. And if I had to pull this line, okay, this line comes right across to um, the tops of that level. And as we do know, that is the cup and the handle pattern. Okay, but another thing here, if I had to pull this down, this pulls down all the way to way back down here uh, in the 2013 bull cycle. So my friends, I would not be surprised. And as with all breakouts, okay, we have pullbacks, right? So I would say that if we were to pull back, become a little bit exhausted, we'd probably pull back into the mid to late 70s. Nothing more than that. And I just want to point out one last thing here before I um, leave you for the day. This line here, I drew months and months and months ago. And Bitcoin, just like clockwork, hit it, hit the bottom from all the pullback action that we had down here, the selling off here. And guess what? The following day, we made the bullish breakout um, the following two days, we made the bullish breakout of the high here, closed above the zone, and made mega, mega candles. If we look at that day candle there, that is a 11.3% candle in a day. Okay, so I just have to say to you, this here, from this line, 300 days, more or less, is about the average from the points okay of the breakout so let's go and have a look at it from this angle right here from this point of breakout okay this previous cycle was a lot shorter okay so 134 days and then 344 days with uh sorry 344 days essentially bearing in mind we had this nasty ass pullback and then one last massive pull up here and in total, that was an estimated, or since the breakout, was an estimated 344 days. Now, would you be surprised if I told you that once again, the same thing unfolded right here? Three, from breakout to that point, okay, was 295 days. Oh, would you like to see one more, maybe? I'm pretty confident you would. Okay, except I don't have it here, but you can see here, okay, from that low to the high is 51 bars. Okay, so I don't have any more data there but to share with you. But my friends, the data is very simple. We're at a pinnacle point in, in this Bitcoin chart. And with being at the all-time highs, okay, punching right up here to literally $94,000, okay, wouldn't be surprised if we had a little bit of a pullback before we made one more, maybe two more massive pumps, pullback, pump, hardcore, okay? And I wouldn't be surprised if this pullback is very quick, okay? I'm going to say that because we're in a bullish trend now. So the trend is your friend until the end, and this ain't the end yet. You'll know when it's the end, and I'll be here for you when it's the end, and I will do videos for you when it's the end. So make sure you are subscribed to my CryptoBliss channel and my beautiful community. And I would appreciate you sharing this video with as many people as you possibly can. That's for free. You can always unsubscribe if you don't want to be part of the channel. But thank you for being here. And I truly appreciate you in every single way. Have a good evening.